everyone, it's Taylor, back with the BUMC News team, and I'm here to tell y'all about VBS, and I hope that y'all are just as excited as we are. VBS is, oh my gosh, no way, no way, guys. Guys, this is like real important right here. This is Miss Hamilton, and she is the ring leader for VBS this year. Wait, can we? Oh, okay. Hi. Okay. Here, let me help you with this. Hi! Oh my gosh, are you so excited for VBS this year? I am super excited for VBS this year. Woo! What day is a VBS going to be? VBS is next week. It's going to be 21 July through 23 July. That's a Wednesday through Friday from 6 to 8 p.m. Oh my goodness. So VBS is going to be at night this year? Oh yeah. So does that mean that we're going to eat dinner? It sure does. So we have been fortunate to be blessed by Chick-fil-A right up there at Shirts. And they are going to feed us chicken nuggets on day one. We're going to have fruit and cookies. And then night two, we're going to have some pizza and cookies and more fruit because everybody needs fruit. Oh, and night three is our family night. It's a carnival night for everybody. And everyone's going to have hot dogs and chips. And we're going to have a snow cone truck, all sorts of exciting stuff. Oh my gosh, that sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. So what kind of games or activities or what kind of things are the kids going to be doing this year? So day one and two, that's going to be the typical VBS format where we have our kids in groups and we go through the rotations. And we're going to do crafts um, that are really just heartwarming. So we're going to make cards here and we're going to make things for the kids to take home and be able to bless somebody they know who needs a little extra blessing in their life. Oh my gosh, that sounds amazing. I'm so excited. Well, thank you so much for stopping to talk to us today. And if you need help carrying this cotton candy out, I got you. I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much for tuning in to Midweek this week. This was Amanda Hamilton, ringleader of VBS. We hope to see you there. So guess what, guys? We are here with some beautiful UMW members making examples for the crafts for VBS. Let's take a look. Hey, ladies, what are y'all doing? We're, We're having, having fun. fun. Oh, what kind of fun? We are assembling packets for a fun project for Vacation Bible School. Ooh. Don't let anything bug you. <laughs> that looks like fun. <laughs> hey, Amanda Hamilton here with a quick update on VBS. If you've signed up for anything on the Sign Up Genius, please bring it into Fellowship Hall by this Sunday. Um, also, this Sunday after first service, we are going to move the chairs out of Fellowship Hall and get the furniture set up the way that we need it. So if you can help with that or help after your 10 o'clock Sunday school class, also greatly appreciated. On Tuesday, July 20th, we're going to start decorating and we're going to start at 9 in the morning until we're done. That day I will have volunteer shirts available for pickup. And also, if you have any questions about the job you signed up for for VBS, I'll be there all day to answer any questions. All day, meaning until 3. Um, Wednesday and Thursday is our actual VBS standard rotation days. If you volunteer, please show up by 5.30 to be in place. That way we're ready to receive all the kiddos. And then Friday is our big, huge VBS carnival where we're going to have tons of celebration up here, lots of families. So if you aren't involved in VBS but you still want to come, please do. Um, it's going to be a great time. All right. Thanks so much. Now give it up for Dee Stevens, who was one of our amazing adult volunteers at youth camp this week that they just got back from. Take it away, Dee. This year's camp was extremely special to me um, because my son, Stephen Stevens, came to me and allowed me to pray the Lord Jesus into his heart and he accepted Jesus into his life. So that was the biggest highlight of camp this year along with the fact that the Holy Spirit was very much present. As I mentioned in church, um, by Wednesday, all the students went around the whole worship center and gathered in a circle to sing their worship and praise songs. And it was extremely special. We left there in true revival, which was the theme of this year's camp. And everybody, is looking forward to returning for the winter retreat in January of 2022 and the next summer camp, which will be in July of 2022. So I praise God for our youth. I praise God for Philip and his team 
and uh, praise God for their camp because uh, without it, there would not have been the amount of revival that we experienced this past week at Twin Oaks Camp in Buda, Texas. Take care and have a blessed day. Thank you, Taylor, Amanda, Dee, and UMW ladies for helping with the video this week.